No police state ends with me. And we made it one more day. So, I've been seeing these silly testimonials online about the Bartlesville police, no doubt pushed by the Bartlesville police themselves, and or the Washington County of Oklahoma DA's office, Judge Vaclaw, Jane Phillips Medical Center leadership, Bartlesville City Council, or, or others involved in this. As we already know, these people are using their friends and family to try to form public opinion around how great they are and the things they do are just when we know they're not. So these individuals writing these so social media and other comments, silly testimonials about the Bartlesville police, about their wonderful opinion of the Bartlesville police. These people writing are well-connected, wealthy, and or, and most, work for the large corporations in town, or the city of Bartlesville, or the Bartlesville police. <laughs> and they do this post like this. This is, this is some, several of them I've actually read. They say something about like this. I called the Bartlesville police for them to patrol my property and house because I heard a bump in the night, and the Bartlesville police were great and respectful and helpful and even so nice to, to me and my family and friends and so on. You know what I have to say to that? Well, duh! If that was your experience, that is the whole point. <laughs> if you are a corporation or you work for a large corporation in Bartlesville, if you are wealthy or well-connected, you get treated wonderfully. <laughs> that is what a police state does. Treats those people like gods and the rest of us like dirt. That's the point. Ask a poor person that has been beaten or arrested or had their car stolen or house torn apart or illegally detained and searched and civil and human rights violated or worse by the Barsville police, how they feel if they contact the police. They don't even have to contact police because the police just come around constantly on their property, jumping their fences, tearing their fences apart, stealing their property. Give me a break. Of course people that are all three they're all three, employed by a large corporation in town, and these people are also, of course, wealthy and well-connected. They're going to love the Bartlesville police. That's the point. Cronyism, fascism, nepotism, and worse. <laughs> so you individuals making all these silly testimonials online and in person, are you're only fooling your inner circle of sheltered friends and family that just don't want to see how the rest of us have to put up with your Bartlesville police state and corruption. Shame on you putting all these silly testimonials online. I mean, really, silly testimonials from friends and family, corporations, wealthy and the well-connected people. Bartlesville police and all the bootlickers and fascists. Who are you kidding? <laughs> the police state just motors on, folks. And again, I want to point out, what I'm going through is awful and completely unacceptable or livable. But I believe it is about 1% of what minority folks and minority communities are encountering from this corrupt police state. I don't know how you do it, how you stand it, you're tougher than me, and I don't pretend that what I'm going through even remotely matches what minorities and minority communities are going through in this corrupt police state. However, even what I'm going through is too much, and it must stop. And the police state ends with me. And with that said, I'll see you tomorrow.